Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. It's your girl Michelle Mrabu and she's back with another video. If you haven't already seen the title, which I know you have because I mean it's what you used to click on to this video, it's basically a get ready with me natural look or yeah, whatever. So I'm gonna be showing you guys how I achieved this look. It is very simple, it is natural, it's not too much, it's not extra, whatever. So I'm just going to be showing you guys how we achieved it and I really hope you enjoy the video. So, yes. So first off, we are going to start with... um. My eyebrows, <laughs> guys, we are going to start with my eyebrows. I don't even know why I pulled this out. I thought we were going to do, um, what's it called, foundation first. And then I realized I always start with my eyebrows. So we're going to start with my eyebrows. <laughs> yeah, first of all, guys, I just want to let you guys know. Like, I, I just want to let you guys know. I am not a makeup guru. Shoot, I forgot my mirror. I'm no makeup girl, I'm just doing this for fun. Because, you know, why not? <laughs> we are gonna use my nude Maybelline palette. Um, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> what am I saying? Since I'm quite light, we are not gonna use black to do my eyebrows, but we are gonna use this brown shade you see right here. I don't know if you can see. But that's the one we're gonna use. So. Mm -hmm. You don't wanna fill it in too much because otherwise, you're gonna look like you have black caterpillars on your face, and we do not want that, so. Guys, you know, I have never shaped or twisted or done any of that stuff to my eyebrows and I'm considering it. I don't know, should I, should I not? Like, comment down below if you want me to twist them. I will vlog that for you guys. I heard it's really painful, so I'm really not up for it. But if you guys want to see me doing it, I will do it, but only if it benefits me. Only if it makes me look better, you know? If I don't need it, then I won't do it, but yeah. Next, we are going to be using my um, Milani Conceal Slash Foundation in the shade 10, which is Gold and Tan. It's a 2-in-1, yeah, foundation plus concealer or whatever. Uh, so, oh, we are going to use it as concealer as for now for um, my eyelids and to like line my eyebrows at the bottom to make them pop more. <laughs> I'm not a makeup artist, guys, so you're just going to have to use the terms I'm using. You're just going to have to, you know, go with the flow, understand what I'm saying, fill in the dots because, yeah. I'm no makeup artist. I'm just doing this for fun because I like wearing makeup, but it might not be to perfection. But I just, you know, I just wing it. I just do me. So, yeah, that's what we're gonna do. It's almost done. I'm just gonna put in a bit right here, not too much because we are going for a natural. Hey, hey, hey. wow, <laughs> we're going for a natural look, guys. So we are not doing too much today. You feel me? We're just going for that natural glow. Hey, 
you know it's funny how every time I say like every time I'm doing my makeup I'm always like today we're just gonna go for that natural glow you know we're not gonna do too much we're not trying to be extra and then that's the day I go extra so if I don't go extra today it's the Lord because the days I say that I'm not gonna go extra I'll go extra <laughs> Guys, I have two mirrors because I like to see how I look from a closer angle and a further angle than this is, so don't judge me. <laughs> So what I just did is I moist this um, blender, I don't know if it's a blender or whatever, yeah I guess it's a blender, with a spray bottle that I just filled with water, yeah, just to get it moist so it is easier and it blends better, you feel? That's done guys. Now we are, we are gonna get into the eyeshadow and I really don't know what look I'm gonna be doing today. I think I'm gonna be doing a pink, like a nude shimmery pink look and I'm gonna be using my Naked 3 palette. Um, it's a bit old as you can see like all the writing is gone and whatever. It's a really old palette. I didn't even buy it. My aunt gave it to me, so yeah, <laughs> we're just gonna use that. And we are gonna be using, um, I don't, this is pink. I don't think it's pink, but we're gonna be using this shade or this shade. This is the pink, but it's almost done. I think we're gonna be using this shade. Yeah, we're gonna use this shade. Now that that's done, we are gonna get my eyeliner and we are gonna do some eyeliner. Yeah, some liquid eyeliner. As soon as I buy it. So now that we are done with um, eyeliner, I am going to take my Fenty Beauty highlight in Kilowatt Trophy Wipe and we are going to use that to put like, um, I don't know what they call it, I think it's on like the inner part of my eyes right here, so let's do that. Okay, so um, now that we have done that, we are going to go back to um, 
the Maybelline Nudes palette and we are gonna use um, this black eyeshadow shade to put it on my lower lids in the inner line so that's what we're gonna do right now now that we are done with the eye area basically like I said earlier we're not going extra today we're trying to get that natural look glow whatever I know it's not natural if you're putting on makeup yeah but whatever so with that we are gonna go in to my face and I'm gonna prep my face with this this is Nivea cream and um, I'm gonna put on a bit of foundation on that which is you know the Milani foundation slash concealer that I used on my eyelids so that's what we're gonna do and I'm thinking I think I'm just gonna mix both the foundation and the Nivea cream so that I don't have to put too much foundation so that it also looks natural so that's Now we are going to get into highlights and for the highlight we are going to go back to my um, Nude 3 foundation palette and we are going to pick the rose gold um, shade that we were battling with earlier and for this I'm going to use my finger to put it on because I feel like that does a better job than the brushes so uh, yeah, highlight Ooh, ooh I almost forgot to lay them edges, yeah? So we are gonna be using we are going to lay my edges with um, olive oil edge control. It looks like this. And uh, an old toothbrush. This. So, what I normally do is I just sprinkle a bit of water onto the toothbrush. And then I like um, take the little hairs out. You know? The ones that you're gonna lay, you're just gonna brush them out. Not everything because it will get too much to handle, so. are done I just laid my edges nothing too serious simple it's not dry yet that's because I haven't like done that whole process where you like put something on top it wait for it to dry because I don't know just because I haven't done it so whatever this so, marks the end of the video I hope you enjoyed this video nothing too serious everything was simple my earring is coming off yes nothing too serious everything is simple so if you made it to the end of this video please be please be able to give it a thumbs up please also be sure to subscribe if you haven't already and um yeah this marks the end of the video so bye <laughs>